I'm Jeff, and I'm cooking breakfast for the family. So all of these are going to be put together and put in the pan per order. And our first order is going to be my wonderful mother-in-law. I love her so much. And that was my sister-in-law in the background. Look, get a picture of her. <laughs> all right, so go ahead and grab the plate and tell me what you well, put on the plate. Actually, you know what? What I want to do, just because I want to make sure we get the right portion amounts, because I told you I got these small burritos. Mm -hmm. Just let me know what you want in your burrito. And oh, you can I'll tell me how plate. much I can have. I can't have how much I want to have. Okay. Well, because I want to make sure it, you know, oh, yeah. one thing doesn't overpower the other. Oh, okay. So you want sausage? I do, thank you. All right. I'm gonna give you a good amount of sausage. That's my nephew Deuce walking around half naked. Sorry. <laughs> Look, ladies, he's only six. What? Fifteen? Seventeen. Um, peppers. You want peppers? What color? Uh, green. Green. That's it. Mm -hmm. All right. Get some green peppers in there. Mm -hmm. A little bit of tomato. A little bit of tomato. So Actually, I was gonna use the tomato at the though. end. Okay. Actually, I want everything except for the red onion. Okay. okay. So the reason why I want to use the tomato at the end is because the tomatoes get really mushy. So I'm going to add that at the end of it. Uh, I am going to put it on a plate because that's what she wants. But when I cook it, I'm going to put it at the end. The mushrooms as well. We want the mushrooms to hold some type of consistency to them. Because when you cook mushrooms, they get really, really soft and mushy. And I like my mushrooms to have some type of, uh, some levels to them. So I'm going to add some mushrooms in there. Onions, you said? No. Green onions. <laughs> Only green and potatoes. All right, no so, red so we got some scallions in here. Scallions are also used pretty much just for like toppings. So I'll use a little bit of scallion on the top too. Uh, when I for the presentation of the plate as well. I think that might be a little bit too much sausage. A little too much sausage? Oh, you can put that back. Still all good. Is that good? Yep. So we're gonna get some potatoes. And keep in mind, I can't put too much on it because we got a small burrito, and most of the um, the, the wrap is gonna be filled with eggs. Is that good or you want to no, All right, cool. All right, so here's our first order. We got everything she already said. And the cheese on the top, right at the end. Right? And we're gonna put okay. the cheese on the top and the end. Did you want some cheese inside too? Just a tiny bit. There's a tiny cheese on the inside. Let's put that on there as well. All right, so we come over here to our already heated pan. Everything in here except for the mushrooms and the tomato. We want to cook everything first. Everything, I already added a little salt and pepper to everything, but add a little bit more flavor to it. Add everything while it was already separate. Uh, before I joined the military, I was uh, I worked in a, quite a few different restaurants. That's why you see me doing stuff like. I'm just turning the heat off and prep my uh, my tortilla. I'm gonna put this in the microwave for 10 seconds. Just to warm it up. Don't forget your food is on the on the stove. I know you turned it off, but it's still cooking, so you gotta move it around a little bit. Again, this is less than 
the half a teaspoon of salt I'm putting on it. Salt is just for flavor. No, not for nothing else. That's it. You don't need too so much salt. We'll break everything up. So normally right here I would add a little bit more cheese to mine because I don't really see the cheese I put in there. But I, I well I don't really like the cheese. Oh, she's she's mouthing in the background. She don't want to be on camera. It's okay. <laughs> We're gonna add a little bit more cheese. We're gonna add a little bit more cheese to it. Is that good? All right. So we got the cheese. Put everything in the middle, bring in the sides, fold it down with your thumbs, put it over to the middle again, making sure that the food in the middle uh, of the burrito is tucked inside that first roll and just keep it tight. Roll it tight, keeping the, the ends tucked in. Here, So you have a warm burrito right now. And with that being said, it's easier to roll. It's a little bit softer. But what we're also gonna do it's crisped up the burrito because there again, caramelization makes everything taste better. So I'm gonna spray it with a little bit of canola oil, non-stick. I'm sorry, coconut oil. There you go. Non-stick. Spray that on. This is to help it cook and not burn. Alright. So I got my hot pan over here. It's probably not hot enough, but let's turn it up. Crank up the heat a little bit. Oh, another good thing is to make a plate look pretty, paprika, one second. Don't taste like nothing, but it make plate look good. So I'm gonna take a little pick. We'll pinch of it. I'm gonna just drizzle it on the plate. Boom, there goes my paprika. Oh yeah, I got some. Another season that don't really taste like nothing, but make plate look good. Some parsley. All right. Look at that dimension already. You can either get a spatula or you can get some tongs to take this out. I'm gonna use a spatula for now. Got to bring my plate over here.
just needs a small one. Let's make a funnel. Uh oh, let's have. Don't forget about your your burrito in the oven either. This is arugula, baby arugula. A little circle here. Paprika. Right here. Pinch that on there. Who's like that? Let me put some tomato on there. Uh, also, you know what's a good idea to put on here? It's actually a good idea to take my burrito out right now. <laughs> yep. Okay. Mm -hmm. That thing with a charge. Take this over to cut more. probably took about 15 to 20 minutes to go ahead and prep everything. I prepped the, uh, uh, for the uh, potatoes and the uh, sauteed vegetables. Um, but other than that, it was simple, it's easy, everybody liked it, and you can do it too.